at 5.30, our top story, the release of Alan Gross and the release of three Cuban spies jailed here in the United States. Tonight, the families of four men who were killed in the infamous Brothers to the Rescue plane shootdown are reacting to the big news. And as you might imagine, they are upset that those spies were released. CBS 4's Marianne Martinez is here now with more on what they're saying. Marianne. Well, Rick, uh, upset is uh, an understatement. They're outraged tonight. These families of the victims killed by the three spies released in the deal with Cuba, they say they didn't even get a heads up from Washington that the release was going to happen. I like to say that not only do I feel that I've been slapped in the face by our president, I feel that the justice system of the United States of America today has suffered a big blow. A big blow for this mother. Her son was one of four members of Brothers to the Rescue. The humanitarian group flew over the waters between Florida and Cuba on humanitarian missions to aid Cubans trying to escape. In 1996, their plane was shot down. Five people, including the three men released in the deal with Cuba, were convicted of planning their deaths. They were villains and they deserve to be in jail. And Gerardo has 